What's going on, everybody? Happy, happy uh, Wednesday. Wednesday it is. Midweek hump day. Um, this is something I've been following, and I know a lot of people have hit me up about the platinum card breaks thing. I've been really looking into it, and I, I'm not going to hit in this video. I might talk about it in a later video this weekend. Um, but let's move on to this here. This was actually really big news this week. And I just got to find where it's at. I think it's this one. Boom. There we go. All right. So a Jordan PSA 10 sold on my slabs. I want to say it was like 170. I think it was 170,000. Something like that. I can't remember offhand. I just remember the post on to it showing up. Well... Basically, people started calling this card out, and then, you know, my slab started looking into it and everything, and they found that there's discrepancies into this. And there's a lot of work that goes into this stuff, because you got to remember, this is a newer slab. It has the PSA little hologram on it and everything like that. It has the PSA indenture down here, if you guys can see my mouse, right down here. I don't know about the hologram piece on to it or anything like that. Um, I don't know if somebody was able to pop it open and replace the Jordan inside, whatever it may be. But my slabs got with PSA. They did their thing. They connected the original owner with uh, PSA, and they're working to figure the whole issue out and everything onto it. Don't know what will come of this or if it will be put out publicly or not. But another one of these have pop, you know, come up. And this has been within the last couple of years. Tons of these have showed up. Uh, mostly you catch these as raw or in some kind of sham faction grading company thing out there. Or somebody trying to forge a slab and all that. But this here really caught the attention of a lot of stuff. And I know it was pushed out on many social media things, and it kind of got buried because of the Platinum Card Breaks uh, piece that went on during the pa this past week. But in case anybody was curious on to it, this, they pushed it on Instagram and everything like that. If you go through there, uh, I guess Nat Turner, David Steinberger. If you guys ever have like a real big issue with PSA, David Steinberger, if you could find him on social media, he's really good in responding and helping out on stuff. Um, I just one of those things out there. If you have some kind of issue with PSA, I would reach out to him if you're not getting any direct answers because. He really has done a good chunk of stuff on his own over the past, I want to say, year, maybe two years. I've seen people reaching out to him for assistance, and he's really gotten a lot of uh, answers and stuff back to where it's, it, you know, the process has gone quicker, smoother, and easily um, onto it, which is a good thing. Very good thing um, that goes on with that stuff. At least when there's somebody's being made aware of it and they're on a social media platform, they're not, you know, neglecting it and stuff like that there. I mean, it might be his personal account and stuff, but he still takes his stuff to heart, and that's one thing you need out here right now. But wanted to hit this up real quick uh, with it because still a ton of fakes out there. It just shows. Uh, if you guys remember the black light, I showed you guys the holograms. You can look at both sides onto here. I don't know, again, if this was something that was cracked out or somebody tried to just make something new into it or there's a new slab type out there. I'm guessing if it turns out being somebody has now gone overboard with uh, now being able to make a slab like PSA with a label and everything, we'll hear more on to it. A lot of times that's why I ask people, um, if you ever see some of my videos, uh, I know there was a couple early on where I asked people if they grade the card themselves, and they say yes. And that's where I usually start looking at, like, okay, if they grade themselves, I'm good. I start worrying where they're like, no, nah, I picked this up, so, so place, so where, and stuff like that. And that's when I always try to start looking at the slabs and stuff like that there before I make a purchase on it. And I'll tell you... If you ever go somewhere to a show and you put a black light, man, the eyes you get looking weird at you. But when you're going to spend big money on something, hey, I'm all for it. 
check it out, look at it. I mean, especially if what I say, tell somebody I graded it myself. I mean, now I know PSA has got my back on too because, hey, they graded his authentic card and gave it a grade and all. All right, everybody. Take care. Got a PSA order coming in tomorrow. I'm going to get that video out sometime in the afternoon, hopefully, that it comes in during lunchtime. If not, it'll be a little bit later in the evening. Um, other than that, got a show on Saturday. I'm off uh, doing a bunch of errands Friday. So if you guys try to reach me, it might be a little chaotic Friday or Saturday. Just want to get that put out out there. Uh pretty much it. Other than that, everybody have a good rest of your week, and I will talk to you later.